When it comes to weddings, everyone wants the perfect day. But unless you have unlimited funds, it's I do, but at what cost? We want something that has a lot of bling. Okay. That and then... sounds like ching, ching, ching to me. It's That's not, not ching, what... ching, it's it bling, bling, baby. That's why we get along. We're I... here. We're, we're right we're, here. We're right here. We are right here. So... Okay, so let's be right here with the price. At the end of the day, who did the vendors ask for a signature? They asked for my signature, right? Didn't we talk about this before? We talked about it, and you said no. Exactly, no. Weddings are a day when sparks ignite. Weddings are a carriage and a horse that's white. Weddings are occasions when your budget's tight. Meet newlyweds Russia and Samir. The journey to their wedding day took them through some tricky financial terrain. Let's follow along as this couple grabs the reins on their wedding planning while trying to keep a firm hold on their budget. My name is Russia. I'm a 26-year-old interior designer. I met my outspoken fiance, Samir, a few years ago at a conference. He tried his best to get my attention, but it took a few more chance meetings for us to finally click. This is the story of how we struggled to plan my groom's dream wedding on a budget. My idea of a dream wedding was the decor, the bling, the ching, my beautiful wife, and oh, most important, I was waiting the for that. party. And it was a fantastic party at that. The party may have been fantastic, but wait until this couple faces the morning after. Let's turn back the clock and watch as this couple tries to create a bash of a wedding without breaking their budget. We wanted to get a wedding planner to make sure that we stick within our budget and to keep him on track. Keep who on track? No one keep me on track. Meet Alistair Reed, who has 10 years of experience as a wedding planner. Alistair has a handle on how to keep overspending brides within their budgets. But what about a groom who wants everything in purple, no matter how much green it costs? Why don't you find out exactly how much it's going to cost? I can tell you right now. Okay. More than you have on you your budget. Yes. Definitely more than you have. My role as a wedding planner is to just bring the best day possible to the bride and groom without the bride and groom killing each other or anybody else. So, you're getting married. Yeah. Are you excited? Very Great. Okay. Great. okay. Well, the purpose wait. of today's meeting is we're just going to kind of like find out what uh, you've got in mind for your special day. We're having a, um, a two-day event. Okay. Yeah, so, so the first event would be like the ceremony. Like just for family? Yeah, yeah. Okay. so it's going to be very low-key. Then the reception, my vision is to have this extravagant wedding. And I'm My talking... My vision. No, 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 no. No? Sorry, the our vision. vision. Our oh, vision okay. is to have this extravagant wedding. Okay. We want to have a lot of bling, yeah. background, big crystals, okay. purple, cake, big, Tall. Everything Can I big. just ask you why purple big. though? Like what else? It's my favorite color. Favorite color. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We don't want a lot of purple. No, I just want to stick to clean, crisp. Add the purple. See, I'm gonna take your purple. Hits. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Subtle. Okay. A little okay. Here and there. Well, yeah, we can. You know, we'll go over that for sure. Okay. okay. I know. My, no worries. Whatever I want, I get. Don't worry. It's going to be a lot of purple. It's going to be a lot of crystals. It's going to be very shiny, very extravagant. A lot of bling. Okay. That and then... sounds like ching, ching, ching to me. It's That's not, not ching, what... ching. It's it bling, bling, baby. <laughs> I've always thought that whatever makes me happy makes you happy. Making me happy will be sticking to the budget. Are you guys paying for yeah. no, both, both? Yeah. Both. Yeah. Oh, because right. yeah. a major part of budget is, is guest count. Like, how many people are you anticipating um... inviting? At least 300, 300, 350. Moving on to rings. Have you guys gone out? Have you picked your rings? Have you... I actually kind of took care of that. You did? So oh, I actually have a jeweler that I want to go to. Okay. I don't want Samir involved in this because I know that he would go crazy and go... At all? Oh, no. Like, you just want to pick them in? Hello. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm yeah. the groom. How can I not be involved? Because Samir tends to overspend. We I have a budget. Not. Okay. We're going to stick to the budget to the best of our capabilities. Yeah. If we go over, that's a sacrifice we're gonna have to make. No, we but won't. But what we're trying to look for together is an engagement ring for 
Yours truly. Uh, no. You mean to give we're to her? Not, no. We, we Russia not, has her engagement ring. We are yeah. not discussing And obviously, I don't. So what I'm trying to do is find an engagement or man engagement ring for myself. What? What's it, what did you call it? It's an engagement ring for a man. And it's called yeah, a, a man, man engagement ring. Man engagement ring. Yeah. We are not having it's a man engagement ring. It's the newest trend. I'm about to start this trend for the rest of the Oh, you're starting the trend. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm starting this I've, for the rest of the That's why I've never heard of it. What about like a grand entrance? Oh, I actually think it's neat if Samira would come in on a horse. Aw, your prince entering. Like my prince yeah. charming. You know what would be even crazier if me and the groomsmen all came on horses? We look I like have one soldiers. Prince soldiers. Where yeah. are you going to fight a war? No, we're going to our wedding. I have one prince charming, one horse, and that's it. I Instead think I having... should take care of this wedding. I love you, and you get to choose everything else in our life. It's, this is it's, one it's day, this like is you... my day. I mean, your sorry, day. this is our day. I don't know why I keep on saying that. This is our day. I think day. that's a sign of things to come. My key source of stress when it comes to planning this wedding is having to control Samir's crazy ideas and having to keep the budget under control. So just to recap, you guys want a grand, lavish, over-the-top wedding with bling and purple, like, and just, you know, that will wow everybody, right? Wow. Samir does. Samir does, okay. <laughs> well, you know what? Let me um, see what your budget is. Hopefully, we can get everything we want within this budget. Okay. Let's see. Remember, it's I do, but at what cost? Wow. You guys uh, wanted bling? Guess it's gonna have to be cubic zirconia. Whatever's shiny and works. Coming up. Why are you coming between me and my dream? I'm not trying to come between you and your dream. It's called reality. Yes. We were best friends. We hung out and we did a lot of stuff together. And then eventually, um, it was kind of like uh, a light bulb went off. And I just sort of looked at you in a different way. and. And uh, there was no going back for me. And then I just had to convince you that you felt the same way, which took a little bit longer, but. A little bit. A little bit longer, little bit. yeah. When it comes to planning your wedding, the most important thing is to stick together. We have a budget. Okay. We're going to stick to the budget to the best of our capabilities. Yeah. If we go over, that's a sacrifice we're going to have to make. No. And at the end of the show, we'll find out if this couple agreed to not overspend or if they just got stuck with a lot of bills. I cannot believe that Samir took me, Alistair, and my younger sister, Najud, to go spy on people's wedding. Who spies on people's wedding? I thought it was a fantastic idea and a fantastic way to get ideas for our own wedding. That's... And at the end of the day, it actually helped out. You have to admit... Isn't that trespassing? I'm telling you guys, just come. We're gonna check it out. We're gonna see what they have. And yeah, I can't believe we are spying. We're not spying. Oh, what's, what's We're spying. Hold We're looking on, at on. other venues. Hold on. Okay, come in. Coast is clear. Come in. Oh my gosh, I can't believe uh -huh. we're doing this. Oh, wow. Actually, this is beautiful. It's beautiful. What about it is beautiful? Nice. What I'd like to get is maybe some purple seat covers, some lavender linens. But you know those are all upgrade. Yeah. You know, we're upgrading everything here. Yeah. That's going to cost more money. No. Yeah. yeah. This is a basic package. So you've got, you know, your basic linens, you've got your basic tableware, you've got your basic cups. Yeah, stuff. you're right. It is basic. It's, it's very basic, and I'm not a basic guy. But your budget seems kind of basic. We're going to set the standard for everybody else. I guarantee you that. But you're also going to go into debt to get it. I mean, exactly. you know, your budget is so important. We have the money. We have the money. We, we do? We'll have the money. We'll have the money. We will have the so money. We, don't we have, have the money. It. Your use of tenses, Samir, is making Russia tense. There's no talking. Let's go to the other hall. I oh, thought there's I'd see more. There's more? Yeah. We're going to check out all the roofs and try to get some ideas to what we can add. I love it. Oh, look at the look at the colors. Wow. This is fantastic. This hall is magnificent. It's the most beautiful hall I've ever seen. We need to get the exact same centerpieces. We need to get the exact same flowers. I think it looks fantastic. We, we will discuss this. Yeah, you know what? We We're discussing discuss it right this. now. At the end of the day, who did the vendors ask for a signature? They asked for my signature, right? And when you can't make your payments, they ask for your car. What is so difficult? To getting you guys like, what? Do I have to like draw you guys a picture? This is how it's gonna be. 
other than the linens, this is exactly how the hall is going to look. OK, can we run without them? <laughs> you can run, you can hide, you can drive. He knows what a mine does. <laughs> it doesn't matter, because on my wedding day, it's going to be exactly this. I really wanted to find a florist that understood my vision. I took Alistair, Russia, and one of my groomsmen, Akram, for a mock-up trial of our flowers. That was exciting. Oh, yeah. What Baby, is, what you you're going to love it. It's my idea. It's my vision. It's me. But what did you explain? Did you just give her colors, or did you we give did her? everything. Da, da, da. Ooh, that's oh, exactly. Wow. It's got the bling on the flowers, the bling coming down. It's Lena, the bling ring. You hit it right on the ball. So how much does this whole piece cost? It's, it's a really good deal. It's $140 together. $140? I think it's a steal. Well, you may have to steal something to pay for it. How about we put it on the table? Wow. Look at that. Yeah, that's Doesn't spectacular. It look no, it really is. It, it really is. is. You Samira, did great work. It, it's beautiful, but really, $140? Let me ask all three of you a question. Does it look good? Yes. It looks yes, amazing. It does. It no looks doubt amazing. about that. It's fantastic. It's spectacular. Yes. OK, if you think that is beautiful, wait till you see my booty here. Can we get the bunier out? Absolutely. I am so excited. <gasps> it's my. Oh, oh my, my god. god. And here it is. What do you guys think? <laughs> that Smear. is my bunier. I'm not sure if there's a lapel big enough for that. Are you serious, man? Of course I'm serious. You look like you're growing branches out of your ass. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <we're... laughs> Why are you guys laughing? What's so funny? I'm sorry. Hang on. Are you going to cover my face? Is he face kidding me? That's bigger than her bridal bouquet. What do you think? What, honestly, would you wear something like that? Hell no. My dead body. I ain't going to wear that. Russia, what's the problem? It's I, I mean, huge. Everything I choose, you guys have it's a problem huge. with. It's big. Are you jealous that it's bigger than your, than your bridal bouquet? Oh, no. So then what's the problem? Oh, no. The problem is, it's another one of your decisions, Samir. How about we scale it down? Why are you coming between me and my dream? I'm not trying to come between you and what your dream. It's called reality. Yes. yes. We have to compromise somewhere, Samir, OK? You're going to scale this down. So you're telling Way me. down. And scale this down a little, too. Scaling this down makes you happy? Then we're good to go. The centerpiece? Sorry. That makes me happy. Um. Fine. <sighs> beautiful traditional dress for the ceremony and I thought by going with my bridesmaids and my girlfriends to go pick out my wedding gown at least I had a say in what I want because that's what happens the girl gets to choose what she wants I think the groom should also have a say in what you get to wear no I don't think so hmm. did you choose what I wore today no so let me do what I do best <sighs> it's a purple dress what do you guys think? Someone explain to me why she's wearing a purple dress. I do not so understand. Samira literally called the store and asked them to pull out a purple dress for her to try on. To Are you in, serious? To fit into his purple theme. Uh, yeah. This is so the fact my that brother. she's actually considering this, trying this on. How are you considering this? Me. How are you even putting it on? Well, I, I just thought, you know, maybe... Well, why shouldn't she consider it? Because, because it's, it's purple. purple. Exactly. What part of traditional is hard to understand? Every bride wears a typical white dress or ivory and never, like, you know, something different. At least you can wear this dress again. Come on, agree with me there. Agree with she me there. Could okay, she could wear it again. She could wear it again, but it's wear. not the dress she wants to wear. What do you mean? Down. You can cut the dress, you can take the bow off. Samir would actually take you out on a nice dinner, and you guys can at least enjoy the dress again, your wedding dress again. Who wears a wedding dress again? Not a wedding dress. Sports Samir value. would love you. I know. Taking his side, but you see? sorry, it's her opinion. It's what she wants to wear. But it's their wedding. And okay. I think, would you wear a purple dress? I think if my husband wanted me to wear a purple dress, I would incorporate some of his ideas. Incorporate? How much purple is that this wedding? You're making it seem like everything is purple. Yumna, everything is purple. The like linens me? are purple, the flowers are purple, and now the dress is purple. But I don't get it. I mean, why are you like so against the purple? At least she'll like blend in nice. Isn't a bride supposed to stand out on her wedding day? So what is it that you want? I, I want to wear, like, something that's not purple. Exactly. You mean, like, a wedding dress? What other dresses do you have? Well, I picked out one. Say goodbye to the purple dress. <laughs> goodbye. Good, good. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Oh, my God. Bye. I love Isn't this it dress. It's so nice. See? Oh my god, Russia, no you look purple. so beautiful. Russia, I don't know about the purple dress anymore. Uh, see, I told you. I told you. This is it. Forget the purple. Samir, who, who's Samir again? 
Oh. <laughs> Who's he? No more purple. Purple out the window. Coming up. I promise the next time I'm not making any more sacrifices. I'm putting my foot down. Actually, I'm putting both feet down on the ground, and that's it. <laughs> I uh, had to fire a bridesmaid because she refused to wear what was simply required of her to wear. Yeah. And was it too shoes. much? It was. Was it too much to ask for black dress shoes? No, she wanted to wear boots. Do you remember what kind of boots? Big military boots. Or Big silver moon boots. Yeah. So. Yeah. So I fired her. <laughs> when it comes to planning your wedding, it's important to have a point person. At the end of the day, who did the vendors ask for a signature? They asked for my signature, right? And at the end of the show, we'll find out if Samir got what he wanted, or if he had to sign his life away. So I wanted to have a say in every aspect of the wedding, so I had the groomsmen and bridesmaids come over to get everybody on the same page. The only person on that page was you. Beautiful people! Hi, guys! Thank you for coming. Thank you for coming. Hey, hey! All right, guys. So the reason I have everybody here, we got to get the attire done. We don't have that much time. Gentlemen. We will be wearing purple. It's not happening, man. I ain't wearing purple. You're going to wear purple, OK? So purple jacket, purple vest, purple tie, purple shoes, purple pants. What do you think, Bill? Purple flower. That is insane. Samir, that's not going to look nice. Dina, I'm telling I'm you. I'm telling you, Samir, Purple it's... is the new black. I think this group would prefer the old black, which is black. We don't want to look like pimps. We want to look like groomsmen. You know what I'm saying? I have an idea. Please, let us hear. Please, us Russia. Us Please, us Russia. Russia. OK. How about you wear the purple vest with a black suit? Are you guys OK with that? Purple that tie, nice. purple vest, I could do yes. that. I could do that. Yeah, what about the purple shoes? No, purple no. shoes. Okay. Black, black will look okay. nice on black. OK, you know what? I'm going to compromise. You guys are right. Speaking Remember that, eh? of my beautiful cousins and sister looking good, I got a little something, something for you guys. I'm going to take out all the anxiety and help you guys choose your dress. <laughs> I think that's what's causing the anxiety, Samir. Girls, purple. I actually got this designer who uh, did Russia's dress for one of these charity events that we recently went oh, to. Oh, you guys should see the dress. To um, give me an idea of what you guys can wear. I am not wearing wow. that. Wow. Hanani, I am not wearing that. Hannah, you're my sister. You're going to wear whatever I tell you to wear. I'm not wearing that. Russia, you told me that this was good. You said I could bring it up to them. No, 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 no. No, what I said was this. You pitch it to them because you want to listen to me. Right. I told you this is not going to work. I thought you said it was hot. It's hot, but not for not the wedding. Not for the wedding, Samir. OK, not guys, guys, guys. Can you see guys. us all wearing this? All Why not? three of us? You guys all look good in it. No. Okay. Women, they have different body types. Everyone's OK, a, thank you. So not every dress looks good on every girl. I want to let you ladies know that I'm going to pay for your dress. You're not doesn't matter. for anybody's Why not? Dress. The dress is like $400 each. When did bribery become part of the budget? You pay $200, you pay $1,000. I don't care. I'm not going to wear it. How about we all pick our own styles? I agree. That's a good and, idea. And that way, it will, exactly. it will be a dress that will complement all of us. But I'm willing to pay for it. You don't have to worry about it anything. Samantha, so they're not going to wear that. that. Like, you have to understand it's not about the money. It's the fact that we want to feel comfortable. We want to also be able to get a dress that we're going to wear at another date as well. So, girls, yes, no? No. no. I told you so. I didn't get anything I wanted. This meeting was a waste. So I'm all about studying new trends and having people follow my unique ideas. So when looking for the cake, I wanted something out there, something that would blow people away. All I hear is ka-ching, ka-ching. Ching, ching. We're looking for um, a cake for our wedding. All right. I actually have a picture. I went online and uh, got this picture out of a tower. A macaron tower. 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 That's a tower. Oh, the tower. macaron towers. Yeah. Right. So we're looking for a five foot macaroon tower. Oh, five, five foot. Five foot. Purple. Maybe we should take this groom and his cake down a few notches. Guys, it's the new thing, it's the latest trend. Well, the macaron towers were great about a year ago. They sort of become like cupcakes, sort of passe. Oh, you know, not what? so great and, and anymore. We're, we're, we're not trying to follow that. We're trying to set the trends. So. All right. Well, I have just the thing for you. What's that? Our latest and greatest creation is our macaron Q cake. Yes. Oh wow! Oh, something. Look at the colors. Purple. Done. Wow. <laughs> I love this. I love this the idea. Beautiful. And can we we can customize this however Absolutely. we want, right? So we can add different colors, layers, layers. colors sizes. Oh, wow. And you have the two cake layers here. Okay. As few or as many as you like, of course. Did you hear what he said? As few. few. Or as many. No, he said as few. He didn't. Or as many. We like few. We like the few part. We like and the few. I like the many. Right? Can you do this in five feet? 
like five feet tall? Absolutely. Yes. Well, no, no wait, no. no. The yeah. question is, the real question is this. How much would something like this cost? The current KQC here would run anywhere from $300 to $350. Oh, that's actually good. That's, that's, that's in our budget. That's so nice. That's in our budget. This that's would nice. cost three to $400? About. So then a five foot tower would squared? Why? It would, cost. it would run you anywhere between 700 to 800. You like this? Love it. It is the hottest trend. That's what you're all about, right? The newest this, the mm -hmm. hottest this. Really that's, why, right? that's why we get along. We're I, here. We're, we're right we, here. We are right here. So, okay, so let's be right here with the price. Huh? This works for the price that we... But it's so small. It's not grand. It's not flashy. It's not elegant. It's not... It's not Samir in Russia. I think the price is all Russia. I think this this could work. And then you could have, like, the purple. I'll give you the purple here. I am willing to make the sacrifice. Uh, but here we go. I promise the next time I'm not making any more sacrifices. I'm putting my foot down. Actually, I'm putting both feet down on the ground, and that's it. <laughs> maid of honor Ellie to go figure out and sort out Samir's grand entrance. Little did I know we were not on the same page yet again. He had his own plans, his own ideas, and I had to take care of it. Aww, they're so beautiful. Hi, Oh, these are gorgeous. Nice group of horses, eh? Yeah. So what I need you to do is uh, take a look at these horses here. Tell me which one you would really like to see Samara on. I like that guy in the middle right there. Well, the, the one with character throwing hay around? Yeah. <laughs> that's lightning. All right, so you like that one? Yeah. OK. So what that's going to bring you is, is Samara's going to have that horse decorated for his entrance. OK. okay. Um, he will be the only horse of the six that is going to be decorated. Why would you, we, we only want him though, just yeah, but, that one but horse. The groomsmen are supposed to be mounted as well, so I can't decorate all the horses. I don't have the costumes there, for There is no horses for, for, for no groomsmen. There's only one horse. I came here to pick one horse. Why, Samara why, booked what? six horses, five for the groomsmen, and one for himself that's decorated. What? <laughs> Maybe this couple should talk more. Are you serious? Uh, he, he booked six horses? Six horses. There's no way. But that's that, a good that, idea, though. That's not a good idea, Ellie. Can that's you not... imagine them all coming in you in horses? Have, how much is one horse? To get a single decorated horse is 535 for the hour, and that's all and inclusive. He, he, and he called He's in for six? Booked six. The bill is around There's... $3,300 no. to get no. all six horses. This can't work. Why, no. though? No. What do you mean, why? It would be great. It would be we beautiful. We can't afford it. I came here to pick one horse. No, I think we're just going to pick one horse. I'm going to go and get, because I, I still have to have you pick out the costumes. So I'm going to okay. go and get a sample just of the costumes. Costume. Yeah. And I'll let you guys figure out the rest of the... Okay. All right, so I'll All be right. right back. All right. I don't know what to do. The idea of him coming in a horse is fantastic, but having me waiting around and doing nothing while he yeah. arrives in his horse is ridiculous. Yeah. You know, that's cool. Ah, really pretty. I like that idea. I like this. It is beautiful. Do you know what? We should get the groomsmen to pull it. <laughs> We're gonna use this carriage. <laughs> Let's go, groomsmen. <laughs> Higher up. Take me to my hall. <laughs> Shouldn't you check if this carriage comes in purple, Russia? Okay, so this is a sample of the outfit. Um, the decorations do cover the whole horse. Right, as you can see, there's a lot of a lot of bling here. Yeah, and Samir is all about the bling. <laughs> Too bad Samir wasn't all about the budget. What if we were to get something like this? How much would that cost? The carriage? Yes. With a single white horse pulling the carriage, it's $650. I think that's a fantastic deal. So you want to drop the decorated horse idea? Yeah, I think I think we're going to go with this. All the groomsmen thinking they're going to get horses and we're going to have to walk. Whoop them, whoop them. Let's go. Coming up. Did we talk about this before? We talked about it, and you said no. Exactly, no. The idea about having uh, engagement rings for both of us was a, a decision that we both made. And uh, the reason why we did it was that we we're both making a commitment to each other. And there's no reason that I shouldn't also be showing that, uh, that I'm also engaged. It also kept the girls away, too, so. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes to the vision for your wedding, it's sometimes necessary to use bribery as a motivator. I want to let you ladies know that I'm going to pay for your dress. You're not paying for uh, anybody's dress. Why not? Dress. The dress is like $400 each. You pay $200, you pay $1,000, I don't care. I'm not going to wear it. 
And at the end of the show, we'll find out if this groom's spending was in style or if their budget was left in tatters. I ordered wedding bands for Samira and I. We went with Samira's sister, Hanan, myself and Samira to pick them up. Little did I know that Samira had plans of his own. I should have known better. Baby, I always have plans of my own. I know. And you're right, you should have known better. It's my fault. We're here to pick up our wedding bands. Okay, he's ready too. I'm very excited. Okay, <laughs> just give me a second. Sure, no problem. Okay. Baby, I hope you pick me something really nice. Well, of course I You're want. gonna judge it. Ooh, see, my woman knows what oh, I want. Sure. <laughs> well, it's easy, because you keep reminding her. I'm glad really nice. Oh, look at it. I'm glad you like it. I love it. That's good. Here, Rasha. Oh, I love my job. Beautiful setting. Okay. So, baby, you know what I was thinking? Mm -hmm. Since we're already at the jewelry store, why don't we look at my engagement ring? Your engagement ring? You engagement don't rings? have an engagement ring? Not yet. Didn't we talk about this before? We talked about it, and you said no. Exactly, no. That no sounds pretty emphatic, Samir. Samir, yes. you don't need an engagement ring. Hanani, why not? Because you just don't need one. Why would you, you just need one? Do you need an engagement ring? Yes. She's the bride. Of course she needs an engagement I'm ring. I'm the groom, and I'm only a groom once. If you keep this spending up, Samir, you may not even be that. Rosie, <laughs> can, I, can I kindly ask you to see this one right okay, here? Okay, sure. It's one stone. Like ladies engagement ring. Exactly, like the ladies best. engagement ring. Does that look like a woman's ring to you? It shines like one. Why don't we just look at it, see if we can work with it? We can't. I can tell you now we can't. You can. haven't even considered it, baby. Can you at least think about it? Thinking about it will not help to pay for it. Ladies, look at it. No ring? Look how plain that looks. Diamond ring. Exactly. Wedding? No wedding. Money? No money. How much you know does this what? one cost? This one just four thousand. Just four thousand. I actually have good news for all of us. Guess who got a line of credit? No high five for you. No. Ooh, who's gonna pay that off? I will. We so will. We will. Okay. Line of we, credit. I, we're getting married. I is we and we is exactly. I. Exactly. We are getting married. We can't afford this. This is something that I've always wanted, and I don't see why I can't have something that I think I deserve. You seriously think you deserve this? Of course. Seriously, Samir. Seriously. No. 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 Can we bag it? Should I well? Can we purchase I it? Do. Those are already paid. What is going on? What is this? <laughs> what did he just do? Samir, are you serious? I. It's it's decided and it's over. We had a meeting with Alistair to kind of figure out where we were with the budget in terms of if we're over, if we're under, what we I need to do. I was not happy that we were crunching so much on the budget as much as the planning. Budget, budget, budget. That's all I kept on hearing. Guys, it's a wedding. Obviously, you're going to spend some money. The purpose of this meeting is really just to sit down and kind of to see where we're at and budget and all of that, OK? okay. So I'm just going to start listing some like really important parts, and we'll just go through them. Throw it out. Centerpieces. $140 each, that's what we had discussed? Yes. We're good with that? We're, we're fine with, with that? that? Yeah? yeah? Okay, perfect. Cake. All I need to do is verify that they're going to deliver the cake at 1 o'clock. Okay. And we're, we're amazing we're with, with that. that. Yeah. yeah. I'm also going to forward you the information for um, the second cake that I got. They're probably going to deliver about... Why, what? Why would you get second a second cake? Because I wanted it. Another call made behind Russia's back. I needed something that reflected myself. How much was it? $700. $700 for another cake. Why did you take me to that store then? The new trend, the hardest trend, is the newest thing. I need it, I want hello, it. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, there's absolutely no bling around that cake. Hello. But it's the hottest new trend. It's, yeah, the, it's hottest the hottest new trend, trend without is that bling. What you want? I mean, it doesn't go with the rest of our deco. Let's just change the topic for one second. Yeah. That. Yeah. Rings. Let's, let's, let's have a little discussion about that. Sure. We went to pick up the wedding bands, and that was the biggest mistake that I've done. Why? By taking him with me. It was a because fantastic instead of picking idea. up two rings, we took three rings because he wanted an engagement ring. We spent a little over $4,000. $4,000. This I will be wearing for the rest of my life. And you'll be paying for it for almost as long. Your grand entrance. Um, we discussed that you were going to have a horse. Yes. What's going on with that? Hold your horses. I think our bride has some news. I got six horses. 
I mean, all my groomers. Six horses? How much were all these horses costing? Each horse was $5.35. Each horse? Yeah. Each horse. So is that times six? Yeah. Exactly. So you're at like over $3,000. $3, yeah. So I go to go choose his horse. Yeah. And I find out that he obviously has six horses. Yeah. See, I, let, I, let, I let her that. choose the horse, by the way. I did. So I, I chose choose one horse and only one horse. And what is this horse? What are the other five? There is no five. One. You're getting one horse, a carriage, and me next to you for six hundred and fifty dollars. Hold on, I'm, I'm confused. I think that's a steal. I already booked I think that's this. That's amazing. See, exactly. Yeah. Did you change anything? Oh yes, I did. You did not change anything. Yes, I did. You're lucky she hasn't changed her mind about the wedding. You wanted a horse, right? I wanted that's to what ride I did. on a horse. I, I wanted this to, is I want to look like a knight, not like some. Clown you on a carriage. A clown. I thought I was done making compromises. You guys keep on taking advantage of me. Poor old Samir has to make Oh, poor old Samir. I know, man. It's not fair, guys. You guys are taking advantage of me, and I'm. How? I'm really, how? How? I'm how, hurt. how? How? You really hurt my feelings. You got the horse. Yes or no? No, not yes. the horse that I wanted. Yes, it is the horse that you. Russia, wanted. you are my princess, but I don't feel like a prince. I feel like you're. You're like your scrub. You get everything you want. You get everything that you've asked for. Look at your ring. You got a lot more than she will ever get. Right what there. What do you mean? She Look got she... one too. You got a cake? Is this a competition? It's not a it's competition. It's not a competition. It's, it's our money. Saying, it's reality. Exactly. And, day, it's and I money. saved money. Instead of paying 3300 on all your stupid horses, we got something very classy, okay, very elegant what? that we both could enjoy. I'm actually very concerned about where we are, to be honest with you. Me too. I know we've cut back a few things, but we were still over on a lot more things that than we cut back on. We're, we're, not. we're not in a good we're place. Not, You're right. You're in a poor place. Coming up. This is not what I ordered. Well, it's my day. It's my wedding. I got to choose my moon year. When I saw him coming down the aisle, I couldn't believe he was actually on time. <laughs> That's a good one for you. <laughs> Thanks. When it comes to spending on your wedding day, you must be ready, willing, and able to lay down some cash. Guess who got a line of credit? No high five for you, no. And at the end of the show, we'll find out if this couple agreed to cut costs or just prepared themselves for debt. Our wedding day, the day we had our ceremony, was very chilled and relaxed. I just got ready at home, dancing, getting ready, getting dressed the way I usually do. And uh, I, was, I was ready, I was excited, and I was really happy. I had to wake up extra early to go to the hairdresser, get my hair done, makeup, on two hours of sleep. I'm here. Oh, oh flowers, got flowers. The flowers. Flowers. Ready? Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Okay, ready, ready, ready? These are the veneers. Oh, I love them. The color is exactly what you wanted, right? So cute. And then this is for the head table. Oh, I love that. I'm not going to take it out, but it's what heavy. Is, what is that? Um, this is, there's a few more veneers in here. OK. Um, Actually, you know what? There's only yeah, like one. Only one? One for There's what? Only one. Do you think Samir called her? Oh, no, he didn't. Is this one here? Oh, that's one video. I wouldn't either. No, that's... That no, is definitely that one is, that, is, that is unacceptable. Like, we already spoke about this so many times. You know what? I'll, don't worry. I'll, I'll look after it. I'll take it Actually, back. you know what we could do? Can we take this apart and maybe put some in your hair? Yeah. I like that idea. Yeah. So then it'll accent good. everything. Yeah. Yeah, no. Tear it all apart. <laughs> Tearing that up is going to tear your groom apart. I'm going to thank him later for the extra flowers he ordered for my hair. <laughs> Don't get nervous. You know me, Dad. I live and do fantastic under pressure. Your budget, on the other hand, doesn't do as well. Hey, good, good to see you. Good to see you. Today's the day, huh? <laughs> is that my one here? This is it. OK. Nothing is for me? Don't free. You ready? Oh, come on. No problems, Alistair. Not today. Sorry, sorry. Not today. Russia saw this, yeah. and she started freaking out because... I spoke to Lena, and I hope you guys didn't make any changes. Well, that's I... the problem. We didn't know that you had gone back and, and, and changed that, so that's why she saw it, and she freaked out. She got really kind of... Who freaked out? Russia. About she what? said, I don't want to have a boot near that big, and there's no way. And Samir went behind my back and started getting all diva like, and she didn't want it to be no. as big as it was. Alistair. It was basically inside this box. Alistair, no, 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 no. This is not what I ordered. 
Well, that's it's my day. It's my wedding. I got to choose my bonier. I can't believe you guys well, went behind my back and did ba that. Basically, what she did was she had the one big one that was in here. She took them out and she put them in her hair. I'm gonna freak. Out. Like you know what? It's her day. This is her wedding day, and I don't want to get mad. But Alice, you know me. No, I know. You I know. know I like the bling bling. Ching, I know. Ching. I know. We got it all. We got it all going. But again, this is your bride, and this is your bride's wish. When have her wishes had anything to do with this wedding? This is too big. It's not okay. big. You know what, this Dad? The one that whatever she choose, just go ahead. It's the wedding. The it wedding. makes her happy. On the ceremony day, I was pretty nervous. I was scared. I I I didn't know what to think, but um, I was excited. I was excited that we were finally gonna be man and wife. Yeah, it was, and it was so touching. It was so touching, especially when I saw you cry. I I didn't yeah, cry. Yeah, you Come did on. cry. You did. I teared, I'm not gonna lie, but yeah. you, you were crying. No, I wasn't. Yeah, you were. I had something in my eye. Russia. We just had our ceremony and it was such a beautiful event. Yes, Russia it was. came in and she took my breath away. Aww. She was the most beautiful thing I ever saw and I love the dress. Thank you. We're finally gonna go home as husband and wife and we got one more day to go. One more to go. We're so excited. We can't wait. But it's just party, 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 party and we're ready. We are. Aren't we? Yeah. I love you. I love you. My wife. <laughs> Coming up. Okay, so let's see. Hopefully this will work. So this will, oh, see, they're already cracking though. I know. No, that looks... It's not working. It's not working at all. Well, we had two weddings. Uh, the reason being uh, is uh, basically if we missed one anniversary, we got a second anniversary to, uh, to cover, which is kind of nice. Also, you know, we come from two different cultures, so uh, we had to do two different ceremonies. That was double the fun. Yep. <laughs> when it comes to your wedding day, remember to take pleasure in the small details. I'm gonna freak out. Like, you know what? It's her day, this is her wedding day, and I don't want to get mad. But Alice, you know me. No, I know. You I know. know I like the bling bling chin I know, chin. I know. We got it all, we got it all going, but again, this is your bride and this is your bride's wish. And soon we'll reveal if this groom was content with small flowers or was just left with big bills. Reception day was actually very, very beautiful. Um, it started off early in the morning for us. It took us a while to get our hair and makeup done. We made it in the end. We got to the photographers. We took beautiful pictures. He got to see me in my dress. It was exciting. It was a beautiful dress. Thank I loved you. it. I loved it was exciting. It. Go Russia! Go Russia! You guys, we did such a good job. Like everyone, yeah. Yeah. all your dresses compliment you guys. Thank God, eh? I yeah. think Sam Samir's gonna like it, I think. For sure, he'll sure. be happy. Yeah. Can you believe yeah. if you actually wore the dress that he told you to wear? Oh my God. <laughs> I know. Everybody looks great. Yeah. yeah. Especially this one. <laughs> Yep, come and take a look at this. Oh, God. So now we're thankful Samir got the second cake. Susie, there was a bag that um, I saw when they delivered the cake. Do you oh, know where that yeah, is? Oh, yeah, yeah, it's right here. Yep, they sent oh, along yeah. a bag. Okay, perfect. Because yes. I remember there was like a couple of extra things. Okay, there's a couple of extra macaroons in there. Right, so let's see, hopefully this will work. So this will, oh, see, they're already cracking though. I know. No, oh, that looks... It's not working? It's not working at all. Luckily, it just it cracked even more. Yeah. Okay, this one at least we can do that. 
Because they're, they're just so delicate, like you really can't do anything. There we go. At least it just hides all the glue that was yep, there from it before. Does. Okay. You know what? We did what we could do. That's mm -hmm, it. Mm -hmm. No, unfortunately, this is the you card we were cake. dealt. <laughs> save the cake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Just notice the glitter nail polish or hoof polish. What is that called? It's called bling. That's a lot of bling. <laughs> wow. It's called bling. Where's the noise? Bring the noise. Let's put our hands together and welcome the brand new Mr. and Mrs. Yassif! And with the grand entrance, it was time for the rings, the cakes, and the festivities. Our groom can't resist showing off the bling. Cake number one. Cake number two. And the dancing went on all night long. This was the best night of my life. <laughs> I swear to God, I had the best and most beautiful bride in the whole world. It was so amazing. Everything was perfect. It was, it was so worth amazing. every single penny. And I'm so glad we did it big. I told you, baby, we could do it big. I told her we could do it big. The purple wasn't that bad, too. The purple was beautiful. Everything was beautiful. And we did it together, just it me good. and my wife. Mm -hmm. I love you. I love you, too, baby. <laughs> They may have done it together, but the bills may just pull them apart. The original budget we handed to Alistair was $40,000. I thought the element of the horse and carriage was fantastic. I loved everything about it. The six horses for me and all my goods would have been a lot better, but I had to compromise once again. Total cost for the horse and carriage was $650. The two cakes were a little more than what I had in mind but they looked great and they tasted fantastic. The combined cost was $1,050. Alistair was fantastic, came through for us in the crunch. The total cost for our wedding planner was $2,500. For the ceremony, my mom bought me a beautiful purple dress. For my reception, I bought a spectacular dress that I fell in love with, including accessories cost me $3,000. The decor looked exactly the way I wanted to. People are still talking about how beautiful the hall looked, including flowers, backdrop, linens. Total cost was $8,200. The venue that we found was actually perfect for us, including location fee, catering, and refreshments. It came to $17,600. Miscellaneous costs, including the limo, rings, and my man engagement ring, and photography, total cost was $12,560. What we actually spent was $45,560. Which puts us over by $5,560. Whose fault is that? It's mine, but it's... Oh, at least you that, know. That barely made a dent in what I really wanted to do. I wanted to spend at least $50,000. You're out of your mind. Baby, it's our wedding day. It's our wedding day. Don't you want to make me happy? Yeah, don't you want to live in a nice place instead of living on the streets? Eventually, but as long as I'm living with you, it doesn't matter where I live, because I love you. I love you too, thank you. Anyways. The hall had bling, the cake had bling, and even the horse had bling. The only question left is, was Samir jealous of the horse's bling? I was definitely the main planner for the wedding. Yeah, you got that right, right? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> as our ceremony was happening, there was an air show in the area, and I think as we were saying our wedding vows, it was almost like we had a, uh, uh, what do you call it? A, a flyby. A flyby, that's yes. right. <laughs> so I'm not sure if we really got the we wedding. We didn't read the banner that said, don't do it, but. <laughs>